Did you notice Windows PC is very slow, not responding, and disk usage is consistently at 100% in Task Manager? Sometimes after a Windows update, you may notice high disk usage, even when you are not running any intensive programs. Several factors can contribute to high disk usage. Problem with disk drive, background app activities, and corrupt system files are common. Depending on the cause of your problem, you can try different methods to fix the high disk usage issue in Windows 11 or Windows 10. Here are some of the most effective solutions that have worked for many users. Sometimes, a simple restart is all you need to fix the problem. Restarting Windows refreshes the system memory, clears temporary glitches, and stops any background processes that may be causing high disk usage. It's a quick and effective way to give your system a fresh start. Windows updates often include bug fixes, security patches, and performance enhancements. These updates address underlying issues that may be contributing to high disk usage, while also optimizing system performance. Keeping your system up to date ensures that you have the latest improvements from Microsoft. Open settings then Windows update and hit check for updates. In addition go to advanced options then optional updates. If any optional Windows updates or driver updates are available, check mark next to it and allow them to download and install. Once update download and installed, you need restart your computer to apply the changes. Many applications automatically launch when Windows starts, running in the background and consuming system resources. By reducing the number of startup apps, you can decrease the workload on your disk during system boot, potentially alleviating high disk usage. You can open Task Manager and switch the Startup tab to disable unnecessary startup apps. Also, you can manage startup apps by opening settings then apps and startup. Here toggle off switch next to the startup app. Viruses and malware can run hidden processes that consume disk resources, leading to high disk usage. Performing a full system scan using Windows security or third-party antivirus, and removing any malicious software not only resolves the 100% disk usage issue but also ensures the overall security and integrity of your system. Booting into a clean environment disables non-essential startup processes and services, helping to identify if third-party software is causing high disk usage. By isolating the issue to a specific software or service, you can take appropriate action to resolve it. To perform a clean boot, open the system configuration tool using msconfig, disable startup items and services, then restart your computer. While services like Windows Search and SysMain, formerly Superfetch, are designed to improve system performance, they can sometimes lead to excessive disk activity. Disabling these services temporarily can reduce disk usage and alleviate the strain on your system. This could be particularly effective if you notice high disk usage during specific tasks or operations. Sometimes problems with disk drives or bad sectors can impact the system performance, causing high disk usage. Disk errors can occur due to various factors, including software bugs, hardware malfunctions, and power outages. Running a disk check helps identify and repair errors, maintain the health of your disk, and prevent further issues that might contribute to performance degradation. Open the command prompt as administrator, and run chkdsk command. Type Y and press the Enter key to schedule a disk check on the next reboot. By checking for and repairing disk errors, you ensure the integrity of your file system and prevent further data loss or corruption. This maintenance task is essential for maintaining disk health and optimizing performance.
Over time, your disk accumulates temporary files, system cache, and other unnecessary data. This can consume valuable disk space and contribute to high disk usage. Running Disk Cleanup removes these unnecessary files, freeing up disk space and reducing disk congestion. This simple maintenance task can significantly improve system performance and responsiveness. Virtual memory, also known as the paging file, supplements physical RAM by using disk space as temporary memory storage. Adjusting virtual memory settings can optimize disk usage for memory management, reducing reliance on the disk and alleviating high disk usage. By resetting virtual memory, you ensure efficient memory allocation and improve overall system performance. Outdated or incompatible device drivers can cause performance issues, including high disk usage. Updating drivers ensures compatibility with the latest Windows updates and may include optimizations to improve disk efficiency. By keeping your device drivers up to date, you maintain system stability and reliability, reducing the likelihood of disk-related problems. You can open Device Manager to update or reinstall device drivers. Also, visit the device manufacturer's website to download the latest driver version. Alternatively, you can use dedicated driver update software that automates the process, such as Driver Booster or Driver Easy. These tools scan your system, identify outdated drivers, and provide one-click solutions to update them. Sometimes, corrupted system files can be a major contributor to 100 disk usage on Windows PC. Running System File Checker SFC, and Deployment Image Servicing and Management DISM, helps identify and repair these files, ensuring the integrity of your system and addressing the root causes of performance issues. Open the command prompt as administrator and run command SFC slash scan now to run the System File Checker utility. This will start scanning your system for corrupted files and attempt to repair them. This process may take some time to complete. By running these utilities, you can restore missing or damaged system files, resolving the underlying issues contributing to high disk usage. High disk usage can be a common issue. I hope these steps should help you resolve it. Don't forget to share your feedback on the comments below. Thanks for watching.